New Year's Day today. What are your hopes for 2015? I don't know where to start. Three points is what we need. Herrera needs to start. Hopefully we'll get rid of all this injury thing. But if we get all our players fit, you don't know what we're capable of. we got the FA Cup coming up as well. Good news, we're in the next round. The way our season's going, can we win it? I feel lucky. Get in the t top four. We've got Arsenal left in it. We've got Arsenal. I know, I see Arsenal. We can beat Arsenal and Liverpool. <laughs> what did you make of the game today, guys? We're out of the FA Cup. It had to be Danny Welbeck, didn't it? He dove and he scored a goal and he celebrated. It hurt me to watch it at times. We're better than that. Uh, are we going to get top four this year? we just got to do it. No mistakes. Work together. I still think we can. United won today. Just what we needed, eh? I absolutely thought it was fantastic. How about that for Steven Gerrard's last game against Manchester United? Could happen to a better guy, really, could it? <laughs> Did you expect that performance? Not at all. Great performance today. One matter. Two goals, yes. Two. Sexy goals. Being Liverpool is just, just can't get any better, can we? I, I don't know what Van Gaal did to him after the Arsenal game, but they came out like fighters and we won. We can beat City. United have beat City 4 2. How about City? Unbelievable. We played much better than City. And this is payback. We outpassioned them today. City are nothing, mate. We do not aspire to be like uh, Manchester City. We are Man United, we expect. We beat Tottenham. Uh, we beat Liverpool and now we beat City, so... Seals the top four. Next year, we're going for a title charge. Bring on Chelsea. Absolutely. United lost today, but... 1-0. I'll put a bet on it. Please, how much? Shake on it. How much? You want to lose another £100? Let's do 100 One wrong result against Chelsea. It's like it's totally gone. Manchester United have lost the third game on the bounce. Is that the end of Van Persie? I've been top four, the worry now. We've got the goal, we did the job. We're we're going to be in Europe next season. We make hard work of it, don't we? <laughs> Jesus Christ. But now we're back. If our season could be made in any one game, it's that today. Not a great performance, but we've got what we wanted. Fourth position. Champions League, what more can I say? Objective for next season. We still need to put our hands in our pockets, spend a few quid. I can see Van Persie and Falcao not being here next year. David De Gea, I mean, we, we need him to stay. We need a man who can put the ball in the net. This club doesn't celebrate challenging. It celebrates winning league titles. Let's get our league back. We want the title, lads. It's our trophy. We want it back. United have won 1-0. Decent start to the season. I'm really happy to get the three points. All the debuts were were excellent. Schweinsteiger bossed it. Oh, Romero made some really good saves at the end. Are we going to let him go for 13 million and just be made a laughing stock of? Yeah, he's definitely not as good as De Gea. We've got a uh, Champions League coming up. Not hard not to get a little bit excited. Now let's see if we we actually have kicked on. This guy is the future. Memphis Depay, man, an assist. Two goals. So Manchester United beat Club Brew 3-1. Three, three First one was filthy, wasn't it? The right Reverend Memphis has announced <laughs> himself to the Man United order. But he has the potential to be absolutely world class. Say no more. Welcome back to Champions League Football. Well, United have just been held by Newcastle. What do you make of that? Disappointing. Just one of them days. It's frustrating, Adam. Rooney needs to go out there, break the bank, and buy a goal scorer. He couldn't score in a brothel. And Thomas is a red. He hates coasters. That was Thierry Henry S. We came, we saw, we kicked that ass. <laughs> is he worth 36 million, though? We don't care about the prices. Is he? 36 million well spent. Say it again. He is! <laughs> Manchester United have beaten Wolfsburg. What did you make of that? We hung in there. Good result. That is an absolutely massive win against a decent team. I'll take three point, I'll take one nil 90th minute goals all the way through. Lou Van Gaal's red off, me! Lou Van Gaal's red off! Why did you join him, Paul? We're outside the Emirates where Manchester United have lost 3-0. Obviously disappointing day today. What happened? Jesus Christ, that was hopeless. That was uh, as shocking as it was bad. With Manchester United beating Everton 3-0. Class. La last week was an anomaly. Uh, I don't think it's going to happen again. Manchester United have drawn 0-0 with City. There's nothing coming that's dangerous. Wayne Rooney, again, really poor. I keep him in the team, but I'll take the armband off and give it to Mike Smalley. Martial needs to play up top. What just happened, Andy? <laughs> Utter garbage. Everything went wrong, mate. There was nothing there for us. He, he needs to wake up and smell the coffee because we've got big matches coming up now. I'm getting pretty sick and tired of 
Lou Van Gaal and his so-called philosophy. Someone saying Van Gaal out. We're turning uh, performances into, uh, into results now. We've kept clean sheets for how many games? That's five clean sheets on the bounce now. The crowd is shouting attack, attack, attack. Uh, it was a bit boring again. Yeah. yeah, again. The second half was the worst 45 minutes I've ever seen at Old Trafford. If Ronaldo came here, he would suffocate. Where are we going to find a George Best from? It's not like they grow on trees, is it? For us to go out on the first hurdle, mate, it would just be a disgrace. Win our bus Germany, that's it, our Europa League. There's a real lack of enthusiasm and a real lack of desire from so many players. And Tuesday night will be his crossroads for Louis van Gaal's career. His philosophy is, we have 70% of the ball, but we don't do anything with it. It's stick or twist, and if he don't deliver, the door's beckoning. United have lost 3-2 and subsequently we're out of the Champions League. We should have beat BSV at home at the end of the day. Next game, as against Bournemouth, we have to um, uh, attack. We got our beat by championship to tactics. It was ridiculously bad. I know injuries and our back four was child, child, blind, child. 2-1 today. Where did it go wrong? Getting out of bed this morning. 11 players out there. They don't deserve the fan support today. He's playing our fastest player in Martial as a right winger to stop their left back. I, I don't know where we go from here. It looks like end of the road for him, like. His days are numbered. I'm not enjoying it anymore. I've heard a lot of people saying it's time he needs to go. In my head, deep down, I think that someone else will do a better job. Like he has to get off his fat Dutch pancake ass. <laughs> get out of this club or start earning your keep. I feel like we need a guy who, who absolutely understands what this club's about and, and, and it's, it's traditions, it's bringing youth in, it's fast attacking football. Van Gaal, all he did was his uh, crossword. We just have the wrong mentality. I just want that club back to the way I've been brought up on it most of my life. The pressure's always going to build on Louis van Gaal. Four down, starts with J, ends with S. Figure the rest out yourself. I want to see someone who actually gets what Man United is about and that's attacking football. It's not all about winning, right? It sounds daft, but United's not all about winning. It's about the lad who was brought here when he was five years old with his dad and fell in love with it. It's about some Indian lad who first ever experienced watching football was watching Ryan Giggs charge down the wing. Says it all. Anyway, guys, let us know what you think. Get your comments in below. Make sure you subscribe to Full Time Devils. As I said, I'm not a man that wants to see Louis van Gaal sacked, but I'm finding it hard to argue against the people that are saying they think it should be at the moment. Comment below, share, like, see you later. Van Gaal isn't playing under Herrera. Sound familiar? Strootman, Hummels and even Messi are linked to Manchester United.